the series, and every single one of them has been world player. She's been in six finals, she winning five tackle of she, she has been world number eight final of the year, but she's on. On my right, Chen Yufei, China. And on my left, He Bingjiao, China. Chen Yufei to serve, level, play. So the Olympic champion. Yeah, yeah clearly out. Two. Yeah. Steen, I do think end of the court. Of course, one's got a white font to her shirt, and the other has got a blue back to her shirt. They both look as if they're wearing exactly the same colour kit when. Yeah. Uh, and you're looking at it from this side. Yeah. She's wrong. Either the left handed, the uh, repertoire of shots, and so on. The touch. Yep. And her touch. But it's a very different style to Chen Fei, don't you think? Very, very different, but I'm saying. There's a challenge here. Yep, and she's right. Um. And, and she can tailor her game to her opponents, and, and she's developing her game. The way I see it, we saw a much more attacking... Um, and I think... Her great uh, footwork and, and defense. Um, but um, the way her being down played in the early tournaments this year, German and... Um, we're watching the now retired great Roger Federer play, where he's got style and ease and uh, makes the whole thing look easy. Yeah. As it was very aesthetic in a different way from how I look at things, because I'm just the sports fan. You're the purest coaching mind. Keep on going, keep on going. <laughs> That's it, I've said enough. <laughs> I'm not saying anymore. <laughs> You've had your moment. <laughs> Yep. Challenge and six play. Just long. And there are years gone by, in fact, China, since they first competed in the Denmark Open in 1981, have won 20 of the 41 women's singles titles. And there's from many different countries at least eight players who you thought could win a title on any given day. Oh, that's wild. That's gone way long the back line. Because we still have some players from the golden era and we also have some a couple of new challenges, but... But um, where we previously looked at it as our players at the moment, uh, when everybody's in there. Oh, that's gone wide. So it's over. It's a lucky call. <laughs> so I think she changed her mind there. Yeah, in future of women single, not only that. 
but one of them, Patterson, makes it very interesting to follow the World Junior Championships. What oh, amazing! That was a big physical there effort there from her. Service over. Someone in the back and front. And I feel that Wen Chin Fei is at her best, then she is the best player in China. Well taken, well taken by Chen Fei. Wide. And she won her second title from 2015. She won it actually. You sure? She won this one. She won it twice. Yeah, but I, I think I don't think it's uncommon that when you have such a strong um, class as uh, China had with they had Jiang Ning who stayed on basically taught a lot of the uh, tactical play to uh, Chen Fei in the early uh, senior years. Uh, but she stayed on for a long, long time. A little bit about the new uh, classes coming up. And then when the old players, they stopped, and Xie Xinfang stopped a little bit early, much earlier than uh, Jiang Ning. It was Li Shuru who took over, and there's also Wang Xishan, uh, Chen Long's wife now. So they had a really, really strong contingent, Wang Xin, who got the badly injured. Uh, and suddenly they were all gone, and that left the gap. Yeah. What a rally! Oh. And the final smash! Wide as well. I hate to remind you, Steve. But 16. The, the Chin Fei walks around. It's uh, worrying the way I see it. It's making uh, much more errors than usual. 17 all. watch him play and so on, but there's a good turnout today and um, I don't know if it's just uh, just long it's in the atmosphere literally warms up and the shuffles will fly faster in warm air that's good retrieving from Chen and Fei Brilliant! Play. It's gone wrong. And would you believe it? And she doesn't touch it. Yeah, she doesn't.
Good running. It's gone wide. Okay, change your face. Get ready to play faster. 20 all. Deception. It's going long. Ah. Yeah. Yep. There's a challenge here in yeah. Chen Yu Fei. No. What? Missed it. Ah. Opening game. So Herbing Zhao gets the second game underway. Remarkable comeback in the open game. Oi. Well, obviously. Oh, loose serve. Service over. We should can't know for sure, but from, from the game we're seeing choices the players are taking and we definitely say get the shuttles in front of actually have a responsibility then to say to the umpire I want the tournament referee I think the shuttles are flying now too fast I don't know if they will um, there's been discussion because the day's discussed it until right whether the players say something On. They've just got used to playing with slow shuttles, <laughs> and and therefore these seem fast when actually for yeah for us. she was on this side and vice versa in the first game where her bring down suddenly was very very careful, even though she was playing up against the drift and that to me is a sign that the shuttles have become possibly too fast. But you're right, it's a fine line. Yeah. Shuttles have become too fast for a re evaluation of it. Yeah. I wonder how many of the players are aware of that. What they're entitled to, to ask for. And there's more to the message. It says, if the player says that, then the other players ask. And if. Yeah. Down. Unbelievable. Shannon and Faye's retrieving that. Sensational. Oh, what an extraordinary rally. Eight straight points. Taken. I mean, she still managed to get back, yeah. but that was due to Chen Fei's um, errors, and, and we can see now how she could make those errors. We can't really bring Zhao. I wouldn't use a whole lot of energy now because uh, I think it's going to go to a deciding game. But this is how she's going to play when she plays here from this near side here. So that's what she's got to do. But, but um, she's down five points, and she's um, having the more difficult sides. So playing full court against um, two-third court is extremely uh, 
energy consuming so I would never advise her to um, to try a comeback here in, in the second game and that's also why I feel that we should change ends in the mid game interval in each game instead of uh, in between games so that um, you only play half a game on a presumably good side or a bad side. What a net shot from Herbin Zhao. Yeah. yeah. Well. Get three easy points now. Close the gap. Then of course you play. Go for it. Yeah. That's what we saw. Yeah, that's a pity. She read and play otherwise. It was interesting how little she touches it at the net. Yeah, that's in. Yeah. Not much faster than this one. No, no, no. No, no. No faster than this. But yeah. this. And, and oh, perhaps that should loose. sort of um, a third game. Oh yes, lovely placement. Sixteen nine. Follow up. Super angle. Yep, clever. It's difficult because you have sort of the uh, pace of the shot programmed in this. Oh, should be mighty pleased to move on from that scoreline of 11 7. Ah! The third game now. Yeah. Game point opportunity. Service over. 12-20. Game. One game all. And eight nearest to us having level vision one game apiece winning the second 21-12 Irving Zhao well she needs a good start here and indeed that's a lovely shot and the full distance is too old so nothing really to and the head to heads from. the head to heads in finals yeah I don't have that one I think Zhao has won the last two right yep Earlier this year, her two titles. Oi. That was lucky she got out of trouble there. No. This is the other one. The other final they were in was the Indonesian Masters of 2015. Okay. I think that was a Grand Prix gold at that stage, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. And that was... Nice. Look at the pace of this running. Wow. Terrific. That's well played. Oh. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. So that's the way to play both sides. Yeah. yeah. She's really hunting all the way across. She can afford to go closer to the net as well because even in the recovery shots from the back, if she doesn't have full power, well, then she might be able to keep it inside the lines.
short. Yep, that's what it deserved. Tries, makes errors. Well, the Denmark Open every year since 2007. I think that trend is going to stop here this year. Mistake. Oh, big mistake. Oh, oh, oh. That's a big, big miss. Oh. So, three of the next four points. I think she might have a good chance yeah. here. Yeah. That's what she's got to do, Hoping Child. That's loose. Ooh, I thought that was going wide. That's a lovely shot from Herbin Zhao. Good deception. Oh, yeah. She's playing too defensive. Good shot. Excellent shot. Playing it into the body. Play. Service over. Yep, yeah, went through it again, Steen. Yeah. And so. I don't know if you think Zhao has a little bit weaker defense. It's maybe uh, same strength relation wise. Yeah, yeah. nice block. Lovely. Oh, what a shot. Oh, 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 oh. Nice block again. Oh. 
कुछ Two points away from the title. Or just playing the best you can, not giving in in, in, a, in a competitive environment like the Chinese. It's like keep on giving everything you've got. Instead. So it's match point opportunities. It's gone wide and in an hour and seven minutes a third title of the year for Herbing Zhao and a third time in 2022 that she's beaten the Olympic champion in a final. 21-10 deciding game. Umpire just confirming that scoreline. Four to settle for second best. Oh, China. Three 